Hello everyone and welcome back for another episode of Phantom Doctrine. We are in the process of uh, finishing off our Interpol contacts for the next two hours and then we're going to be installing the marquee device. We've got a lot of money, uh, we don't have much danger. It's, it's generally actually going quite well for us at the moment. Um, there's a lot of stuff going on on the map, uh, but we don't need to worry about most of it at the moment. Right, we'll carry on making our Rim Fire Suppressors. Uh, because we pulled Deadpan off, um, his uh, his options changed. In fact, while I'm at it, uh, let's make sure we've got people intelligently assigned to all the different things we're trying to do. Uh, Acrobat, you're already getting that. That's good. We've got two people in forging. We've got no one in the infirmary. Uh, we may as well put Roxy on comms for the moment. Right, Acrobat, you are done. Let's put Stuntman in next. Stuntman can have everything. So, Danazol requires DX Amp. So, we'll start off with DX Amp. We'll just make sure uh, block Xenoxy, block Anubim, which we don't have. So, that's all fine. There's the Interpol Contacts. Reduces heat gained from combat. Always going to be useful that, um, but we need whereabouts is it? The marquee device. One more signal analysis slot. Well, that's that's not a bad thing. It doesn't doesn't feel like it's going to give us much extra, uh, but it's also going to advance the plot. So it's useful in that sense, if nothing else. Okay, so that blocks Danazol, so we need to do Danazol first, that blocks FGF. But we don't have FGF, so we don't mind about that. And it's just a, a process of us going through and doing each of these. Um, but it doesn't matter because the tactical recon on the Beholder cell in Karachi is done. Uh, we are going to send people in to assault this, and oh boy, it's going to be a big one. Uh, right, who do we want to have disguises? We want Frigate in. And uh, let's take Roxy out for the moment. Can we put Doctor in? Doctor is busy elsewhere. In fact, where is Doctor? Well, must be, uh, must be super, super busy. Uh, so we'll put, uh, Redwood. We could take Smash out, actually. Yeah, let's let's take Smash out, and we'll give Jackson the second disc. Oh, actually, we'll lose his armor. No, that that's fine. I think that's fine. Uh, so we've got grenades across the board. Uh, I do want to just check for first aid kits, and uh, we don't have any spares. Do we want to reassign? anyone else's first aid kits just so we have one available to take out doesn't matter that people are traveling we can totally just pull it off them because I always end up forgetting to do this right you get a first aid kit you get a first aid kit basically everyone who's not infiltrating except for dead pang is getting a first aid kit and I think that would be quite good. Uh, sniper regular, sniper loud, and poison gas. And we go. So this is going to be Operation Creeping Queen. We're attacking a major conspiracy hub. Expect fit security measures and heavy resistance, including enemy agents. And this is why we are taking in the big guns. Now, in terms of entry points... None of them are particularly good. Probably number three is going to be best just for actually being able to get in. Uh, in terms of loot, seven and six. So, yeah, I think this this will work well enough. Do I want to go in at the back over here? It's There's only one door in and the rest is all sealed up. So, no, I think we'll, we'll go for the, the double doors down here. Uh, in turn... Huh. Sniping, sniping, sniping. Where do we want to put them? I think probably on the north side. We'll have the silenced one. 
Uh, we will have East Poison Gas. And why not? We'll go for South being the Loud Sniper. And that'll do quite nicely. As always, we want to take out the agents before taking out anyone else, but if we have to go super loud, we'll go super loud. The enemy's dug in deep. Prepare for a tough fight. So, frigate. This is not a brilliant place for you. You can see dude outside. We don't care about him. Yeah. Jackson's in here right by this so actually let's let's grab this now Jackson doesn't have actor so I want to be a little bit careful about where we walk and who we see Frigate does have actor. Let's just make sure. Yep, yeah, definitely has actor. Uh, so let's just charge straight in and we'll grab this. Low noise mine. Cool. And uh, the rest of you. Uh, do we... Like, shoot this guy initially? There's going to be 10. So maybe not. In position. Necro is relatively slow. Necro, step up to the door. Doesn't look like there's anyone in there. Smash can't quite make it. No one can quite make it. Okay. We'll do some jiggery pokery. All right, we can see a security guard over there. That's fine. We'll close that door again. Really, we want to be turning off the security cameras as soon as possible. Uh, close this door again, because as we move people inside, we don't want anyone to be spotted. Uh, Deadpan, can you make it? Deadpan can make it. Lovely. Well, go do that then. This is why we like fast movement. And there's more for us to do, of course, over this side. Uh, in order to actually get to that, we're going to have to go through this door. But we can bring people, uh, namely Smash, in through the main entrance for that. And uh, rather than abandon you to do all your stuff yourself, we'll bring Necro across to help. Now, we shouldn't be triggering anything yet. going to be eliminating people we want to be cleaning up the bodies at the same time as we create them Depan, have a little look through here don't see anyone I mean, we've fallen foul of that before with people like hiding around these uh, these little corners close it up for now and yeah if we eliminate you that's going to be, like, super visible. Smash can get in here, but we don't want to do that. Open open the door, though. That door can stay open for the moment, I think. Necro, go give some support on the outside over here. person's going to walk there you're going to come past this way so that's that's not bad actually we might be able to like do some shooting and cleaning up straight uh, at the same time what is it this time right back upstairs in uh, our wonderful wonderful 127 health super stealth acting mode
frigate's going to take a look down. Hello. We have an agent. All right. We'll close that door. Then we'll get ready to take them out next turn. Uh, Smash, you can stay where you are for now. Jackson. Really, I want to bring you round and in here. But let's do it in stages. Just to make sure we're not going to get ourselves in any trouble, he says. So they're actually coming this way, so we could knock them out. I think this could work. We step here. Turn these off. And then we can move slightly out of sight over here, maybe? Get to here. Acrobat, what are we going to do with you? No extra people to spot. But we're potentially going to get ourselves in difficulty if we carry on this way. So for the moment, let's check the other side of this doorway. Okay, I think this is all good. It is relying on people not patrolling in. And also agents not spotting us. Hey, uh. Deadpan can take this one out. All right, let's let's start right now. Let's do this. The deadpan doing the big whack. So one agent is down. We know where two others are. There is one just in here, and there is one just out here. Standing by for orders. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I think that's all we want to do at this point. We can shoot you. We can't shoot you. Uh, let's um, let's take it at that. Don't mind us. Just you know, standing around. Okay, uh, so we want to stabilize this agent so we can capture them. We want you to knock this agent out so we can capture them. If we do that, we're not actually in range of the camera. So okay. Jackson, go straight for it. Uh, pick them up. And what we're going to do is we're going to, like, store them in the office area for the moment. Uh-huh. Reporting. Can you make up your mind already? Uh, what we're going to do is we're going to step across here just to make sure there's no one looking from this side. And we're going to take you out if as you well. Really think so. That is such a good turn. Uh, right. We can't stabilise them because we don't have the fire points. Um, so we'll wait until next turn. And then we'll do something with them. Smash can't get in, do that and get back out. But Smash isn't going to be seen. We can knock this guy out and clean up his body this turn, though. So let's do this. I think three agents should be all there is. Dispose body. This is how you do stealth. 
Okay, now that that's been disposed of, let's have a look around this corner. Okay, we've got one more guy. Uh, may as well start moving towards him. Waiting on you. Uh, you're waiting there. You may as well come and help out. We're not going to get you inside for a while. Uh, you can actually come in and stabilize this person. In terms of exit locations, we need to drop them just behind that blue bin. So deadpan, please grab them and you can start exiting with them. Just store them by the bin for later. That's all we're going to do this turn. Okay, is that another agent? Or is that just a dude? That is just dude, I think. Yeah, it's just the dude. My skills are at your disposal. Hmm, we can knock this guy out, but we can't tidy up his body. We can't make it to knock this guy out, but we could shoot him. And to me, that, that seems like an acceptable solution. It's suppressed. Is it time to die yet? Waiting on you. Uh, Necro, tidy up that body, please. Just like roll them underneath. So, in terms of bad guy elimination, we are up to five out of ten already. That is going quite nicely. May as well carry on around the edge. Uh, right. Abilities. Stabilize this one, please. Sure? Haven't worked out how we're going to get them out yet. It's probably going to involve this window at the end. but we can at least do it in stages. Uh, Jackson, you're gonna want to go the same way, actually. Definitely don't wanna get hit by random patrolling people. Come to this corner for now. chance of anyone being around there is slim, but it's still a bit dangerous. So you know what? We'll take a step this way and we'll check the door. Can you open that door? No, you can't. Alright, Acrobat, what are we going to do with you? Let's get you over to the next... Can't see anyone, that's good. So we'll keep pushing towards the back room. 
Deadpan, we know we're taking you out to the bin. It needs to be on this side of the bin. For the moment, we'll just get you up to this doorway. Oh, I think that's all we're going to be able to do this turn. I want you back over here so we can find out where that guard inside is. There they are. They are looking the wrong way. They are in view of the, the camera. Uh, but that's okay for now. Necro more scouting. There's one. <sighs> what are you doing? You're just standing guarding. That's locked, so we're not going to have anyone coming through there. So this is the only real problem. Cooking. He's not going to end up an issue. So, deadpan, in you go. Not trespassing anymore, just carrying a body. Put him down. They're unconscious, they're not dead. It's fine. And then uh, actually come up to this doorway, please. Or window. Uh, we've not got any civilians down here. That is really good news for us. Reporting. Waiting on you. Right. Don't see us, don't see us, don't see us. I think we're gonna have to just just book it. Okay, the area is clear. And we've got two of the remaining bad guys what is it this time? on our radar at the moment. One down here, one down there. Three others elsewhere. What? Possibly in there, possibly in there, possibly in this room at the back, uh, possibly in that room at the back. So there's, there's plenty of places for them to be. In fact, Deadpan can, can come over here and help with this guy. Uh, he's going to come over to that window next. Standing by for orders. At least in a bit he will. So if we get... Smash. Uh -huh. Dead pan. If you come over here to this guy. I'm going to step smash in and we're going to close that doorway. Just like that. So we can then turn this off. 
that's going to give us a lot more freedom to move around and uh, dispose of people, for want of a better way of putting it. Uh, that civilian is going to move, so we're going to wait until next turn before we actually take this guard out. What the? Uh, right, as for Can you make other people... He is going to move this way, so he's going to get visibility out, but we can at least step out and down. All the way over to the doorway, actually. Alright, let's do that. No one's paying attention as we steal all of their agents. Uh, do we want to go further? I think we probably do, actually. If I get to here... And then... Drop them down. Are they going to put them in a sensible place? We'll find out in a second. It looks like that is spot on. They are both in the zone. Okay, we're not calling evac just yet. Right, we want you... Uh, that's... All, yeah, get all the way across there. Brilliant job, Jackson. Yeah. Right, while Jackson's walking... We can think about how we want to deal with... This guy. Maybe in from the back with Necro. Let's get Necro all the way over here. Are we done standing around? I trust this is important. Just checking everyone. We can have a look through the door. Can you actually see it? No, you can't see through the door. All right. Let's at least get here. If we have to, we can we can storm in and do some stuff. But approaching from the front, we're going to have to like be sure to kill him in one go. All right, that guy moves one space. He's looking the wrong way. Lovely stuff. Just um, give him a friendly tap. My skills are at your disposal. Uh, dispose of him, please. And once we get rid of all these guards, we don't need to worry about um, doing anything too bad. I mean, civilians can still set off the alarm. They can still tell people where we are. But uh, for the most part, the danger will be past. Uh, Waiting on you. Frigga, I want you coming back in with your acting yeah. skills. Jackson, is that close enough? Not quite, I'd say. Let's Let's do it properly. Stand in the middle, drop him off. Oh, actually, you need to stabilize them. Well, best get on that. Okay. See, they're all fine. They they just all like took the wrong type of drug at the same time. That that's the problem that these guys are facing. Uh, Acrobat, have a little look. He's still there. Yeah. Take down Will, sound the alarm. That won't do enough damage. So let's let's bring Necro in and. Uh, see what other options we have. In fact, you know what? I am going to step to here. We're going to have a little look in... don't see anything from this side. Doesn't mean that there's nothing there. 
We're just being a little bit more careful with how we're moving through. I read you. Uh, you can actually step back in. We're going to need to yeah. steal from there. Acrobat, you're stuck where you are. Uh, we don't need anything else in here, though, so Deadpan, you're coming all the way to the back. Jeez, I don't like hearing people move. Uh -huh. It makes me worry. They're probably just patrolling in there, but... Yeah, he's still in the same place. So... Necro... On you. So, three left to find. Possibly, like, around this area. Possibly upstairs. Standing by for orders. Right. Frigate, you're an actor. So you can get your eyes in on this area at least. My skills are at your disposal. Five out of seven, four out of six. This is going quite nicely. Uh, Jackson, you're an actor. Get back inside. Let's get this Molly's way. going in. We did scout this area. Yep, that's fine. So you can step in, Acrobat. Doesn't look like anyone in that last little bit. So they're probably upstairs, actually. Maybe in here, but most probably upstairs. There's one, actually. Well, take him down. Thankfully, there wasn't two in here. So, two enemies left. And I'd almost put money on them being upstairs. That's the seven out of seven. Why are we here right, again? four upstairs. We've got this room at the back and we've got this room at the back. With Frigate's acting skill, we can just charge straight on in and have a look. And we have one at the back over there. He looks like he's properly guarding himself. Uh, let's bring smash out. We don't need smash in there. Totally not trespassing anymore. Uh, Jackson, for your position, let's get you up. Oh, wait, I know where the last one is. He's in here. Well, that's going to be dead easy, so we don't need to worry about this. Uh, the only stuff is those two last intel docks. So, let's start bringing people for a sensible evac. What's cooking? Uh, so yeah, this guy, we're not going to be able to, to kill him. Yeah. We got one guy in here and we got one guy that Jackson saw in there earlier. I'm 
here. Right. Deadpan, take your team out. Why are we here again? Frigate, you're coming all the way across. Smash, you're just going out. Jackson, we're sending you back in here to go talk with your buddy buddy. There he is. Is it time to die yet? Hey ya. At which point I may as well call free back. I'm on my way. Because it's gonna take three turns for them to get here anyway. Man, this is so funny. Just like dunk dunk dunk. These are the worst agents. I'm just yeah. just gonna say that right now. Uh, so Jackson to the back. Necro up. Right, frigate, you're coming in. Can you also get this at the same time? I think you can. Yeah, lovely. And yeah, if you can if you can start your X fill as well, that'd be ideal. Yeah. Jackson, we want you to do much the same. And there goes all the opposition. Good job, team. Head back home. Cool. Uh, what's going to be the best way to exfil? Probably out there. So we're going to have to go this way and round. Let's get this over with. Acrobat, you're just doing a runner. Uh -huh. And that's it for everyone else. So let's let's try and burn through this quickly. Right, frigate, you're coming over this way as well. Reporting. Necro in. Let's get this over with. Acrobat, come out the front. And yeah, Jackson gets to there. To die yet? As soon as Jackson's done with moving, the van will arrive. I do love that with a bit of careful planning, you can totally yeah. run a mission as a stealth mission. Uh, right. Oh, Frigate, you're also coming down. And a bit of lucky positioning. I mean, if the, um, if the enemy agents were in, like, 2 by 2 we would have to do some breaching instead, and uh, we're lucky that the civilians aren't really wandering around outside. So there's there's things that are working in our favour for certain. Let's get this over with. But it's still going very well. All right, everyone ready? Let's uh, evac out of here. Three enemy agents loaded in the back of the van. Everyone else leaving on foot. Deadpan is just driving them back by himself. Primary mission successful. Primary mission successful indeed. Let's see what wondrous things we're going to get out of this. Oh my word. AMRs, EIWs, I have no idea what an EIW is. Uh, so many new chemical new chemical compound remove ore Ooh, that's going to be useful a rifle suppressor 
more training, war zone operations, shock tactics, and of course, the three enemy agents. Raloxapine, TST, and new perks and training for Acrobat and Necro. Right, let's hop in and we'll do those. Um, so, perks, actor, actor, always actor. Uh, Necro, you've already got a lot of useful stuff. League picture could be useful as like a get out of everything's gone wrong situation. Yeah, we'll do that. Um, right, in terms of war zone operations, disabling a single CCTV central or laser power source will disable all of them. That is so cool. And killing spree. <laughs> Increases their awareness. I mean, that that's not actually that brilliant. Bargain as well. Maybe, maybe. This, on the other hand, this is going to be so useful. PPK and TT. I mean, that's not brilliant, but the ability to knock everything out in one go. Cost a thousand. Let's get that going. And uh, you know what, seeing as you've got actor already, uh, we'll give you interconnected as well. So both of those in for training. Uh, in terms of body engineering, removal makes sense for, for clearing stuff out. That requires our Goxy, which we don't have. TST, very cool. I wonder if we would be able to get anyone up to two fire points. Probably not quite. Circulatory system is the, the big one. I think deadpan's got highest. Yeah, yeah, so that, that's not going to happen. Uh, right, I wanted to actually just check our dossiers. Because I get the feeling that I may have forgotten some intel. No, I didn't. That's good. Uh, uh, but nevertheless, I think that's probably a good point to finish this episode off. We have been going for quite a while. Uh, there's obviously more stuff that we could do. Uh, but we'll be doing all that next time, such as rebalancing our guns and, and selling things up. Thank you very much for watching, everyone, though. I do hope you are continuing to enjoy our foray into the world of... Oh, actually, you know what I'm going to do. Uh, continuing to enjoy our foray into the world of spies. Um, I'm absolutely loving this still. Even though I may not be the best spy, uh, there is a lot of fun to be had here. Uh, if you are enjoying it, be sure to give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, you should do so, and you'll be told when the next episode goes live. Otherwise, I'll see you next time for another episode of Phantom Doctrine. See you soon!